Hey guys, it's um, Jada here. So I just would like to formally come out and apologize for the video that was posted. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So in this video, I'm super, super excited because Queen finally said something, okay? What she said isn't much, but she mentioned certain things like captions on her pictures that says that you know she's trying to bring herself back up i'm excited i'm so happy because like i just said it on my earliest videos i love queen so bad like she seems like a really really nice you know woman in general so me looking at snapchat a couple minutes ago child i saw that she posted two pictures with captions on it so i'm gonna insert the pictures right here that's the first picture. Take a close look at it and read what it says, okay? You know, enjoy the picture. Okay? Y'all see what that says? Just adjusting my crown, okay? And then the second picture, y'all look at it. Can y'all read what it says on it? She ain't even half of me, Beyonce. You right, girl. All right, done with the pictures. She is super right. Like the girl Chris cheating on her with is not even a dime of what Quinn is. Like Quinn is bad. Like I don't care if she had lipo or not. Like she looks good. Now I see why when she tells Chris she want to get a surgery to make her butt and you know body look good in general, he refuses. Even though it's just in pranks. Now I see why because he loves looking out and if she looks really, 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 really she popping. Other guys will be looking. I'm sure other guys are already looking, but if her body's really, like I said, she popping, more guys will be looking. So he want to avoid that because he's busy looking at other females. Like, Chris, sit down. But anyways, like I said, she finally answered. I am super excited. Like, she's finally saying stuff and showing that she's still around, like, and she's sucking it up. And I was really proud. Y'all check out those pictures. Let me show you guys those pictures again. Like, okay. Okay, queen. All right, y'all see those pictures? My girl beat her face, you feel me? That's what I always tell people, when you're going through a heartbreak, I don't care, like, beat your face, I don't care if you're staying home, beat your face, look nice, take pictures, post it on Instagram, everywhere, all your social media platforms. I don't care, like, even if that guy will be like, I'm sure she's still hurt, even though she's posting all this stuff with her face beat, at least it's gonna be like, she had the, the strength to, you know be her face at least that means she's you know working her way out of that pain that's always what I do like before I got into this you know serious relationship with my baby Jordan <laughs> you know before we got into this like I, I had I was I already like I had other relationships basically and whenever me and those guys used to argue or whenever we officially broke up let me tell you child I used to beat my face dress up take nice pictures, take myself out just to make myself feel better and feel good. So I'm really happy that Queen finally answered. And then the next topic we're going to be mentioning in this video is the fact that Jada, which is Helena's older sister, she was one of the, the three girls that did the first video together. The, the main, the girl that has the channel that blew up because of that video that they made about Chris cheating. She made a video apologizing for the whole situation. Let me play the clip, the clip for y'all right here, okay? Hey guys, it's um, Jada here. So I just would like to formally come out and apologize for the video that was posted, the video of exposing Chris. That was not the way to go about things. That was not God's way to go about things, and that was definitely not the grown way to go about things. So. I know that I've caused a lot of hurt to Chris and Queen's family. I know I caused a lot of hurt um, with their fan base. And the reason why I'm apologizing is because I am the oldest out of the three. I should, I'm should i taking full responsibility. And um, I should have been more... I just should have handled the entire thing a lot differently and just did the right thing. So, um... I just, again, I just would like to formally apologize, and I hope from this point forward that we can just move forward from this, and again, I'm sorry. Oh, she apologized, but anyways, I literally think that she was told to apologize. Let me just be 100, like, I feel like she was told to apologize. 
she was i feel that's what i feel like i have the right to feel right so that's what i feel and how i feel like i feel like probably the fact that she has like a lot of followers on instagram and all that i feel like her, she has like a manager or somebody behind her image since she you know i'm sure whenever before she signed up with brands and do all this stuff the way she posts like she's a model i feel like if she's actually a model she has like a manager or someone actually you know helping her figure it out what contracts are best for her and all this stuff i feel like she has somebody guiding her you know even if it's just her parents i feel like somebody in general you know i feel like somebody told her go ahead and make that video and apologize in behalf of your sisters and um she did it but whatever it is she apologized like she stated she did apologize so what can we really say nothing but just say okay she apologized and chris apologized so it's already two apologies you know Chris apologized to Quinn and the fan base and everybody else that was hurt by the situation. And then this Jada is apologizing on behalf of her sisters. And she's apologizing to everybody, including Chris and Quinn. And I feel like Quinn will definitely see all these videos. And I feel like she should just, you know, they apologize. Yes, you forgive, but you don't forget. She can forgive them, but not forget. Which means she can forgive them and move on with her life instead of forgiving them, going back with Chris and acting like nothing ever happened. You know what I'm saying? So yes, guys, that's that. That's it for today's video. I didn't want to make this apology video in a whole separate video because it was like less than a minute. So I felt like putting it in this video was the best thing I could do. So thank you so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below and also give this video a thumbs up. And comment any other video you would like to see next. And, you know, of course, I'll make sure I satisfy y'all. Like, hmm, y'all the real MVP. Best squad out here. So, let's get it. Let's go. I'll catch you guys on my next video. And also, don't forget to comment down below any type of videos or YouTubers y'all would like me to react to. And I'll make sure I do those reactions for you guys. Alright, guys. Bye.